Hi, welcome along to this very special edition of the Ghost Light Sessions, part of the Eric Arts Festival. Uh, tonight we've got two very special acts coming up for you, and I hope you're really going to enjoy them. First up we have Kato Callahan and Seamus Devaney. Hello. So um, my name is Kate O'Callaghan and uh, this is Seamus Devaney and uh, we're absolutely delighted to have been invited along to this festival special edition of the, the Ghost Light Sessions and um, thank you very much to Dean Maywood for that and uh, we're no strangers to the Ballard Theatre um, we've been here a few times before and uh, it is in all honesty one of our favourite venues in Donegal to play in. Uh, so I'm uh, going to start off with a, a song that, uh, well, I wrote a few years ago now at this stage, but um, it kind of feels now more than ever, it feels more pertinent um, somehow. So it's, it's called Lullaby. <laughs>
That's the proof there is an audience here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We had to drag them in in kind of spaceman suits. I'm going to set them at the back and kind of fumigate them and stuff. I'm only joking. So, um, a few years ago, I recorded an album um, that was a, it was a concept album. It was called The Girl with the Berry. And uh, it's part of a larger project called Songs from a Witness Statement. And it's inspired by stories, um, stories about my great grand aunt. Uh, her name is Katie Byrne and her involvement in 1916 and the War of Independence. And uh, at the moment now, we're actually working on part two of this project. Um, yeah, which is great. We're, we're, it's lovely to be um, working on some new music. So uh, I was thinking I was going to start off with a, just one of the songs from the, from the Girl with the Beret album um, called Rising Men Down. And then I'm going to go on and I'm going to do a couple of songs from, from the new project. Because it follows her story, you know, um, as she moves from Dublin after the rising over to Scotland and then spend some time there and she's involved in some gun running and stuff and then she comes back home and it kind of describes you know her story and what she finds as she comes back into Dublin and then continues uh, throughout the War of Independence and uh, it's sort of it's more about looking at the the personal the personal story because her story was was in a witness uh, was in a witness statement report that's logged with the bureau of military history and it's just such a lovely account of the the real personal experience um of a very very ordinary girl at the time but in in an extraordinary caught up in an extraordinary event um which i find really uh, lovely and interesting to to write about so uh, we'll start with we'll start with this one first i'm just going to check my tune in Also, we, uh, we decided that uh, if we did the last album as a kind of a through recording, so uh, if you ever come across a CD of it and not listen to it on Spotify, which ignores the fact that it should be played from start to finish, there are no endings to the song, so the, the two other songs, we're kind of, we've kind of become very, very fond of the way they end, even though um, we're part of the larger project, it, it, it all runs seamlessly, so. but you'll get the idea when you hear it. Bye. 
Then that one kind of does have an ending, doesn't it? It kind of feels like an ending. <laughs> a little bit. Judge for yourselves. So, um, women were kind of largely written out of uh, Irish history, and, well, probably history uh, all over the world globally, um, but um, kind of until fairly recently, you know, in the centenary in 2016, like, did a lot of stories about the women's actions and, and behaviours come out. And uh, some of those actions and behaviours might have been very subtle and, 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 and maybe s seemingly um, not significant, but, but actually uh, were very powerful actions that, that changed, uh, that had a, a large kind of social change over time. Um, so I, I kind of wanted to focus on that a little bit, and, and that's why actually the, the, the next, the, the second phase of this project is called Small Behaviours, and this is the, the title track from that. I'm just going to tune. Funny, I haven't learned to talk and tune at the same time. <laughs> it's okay, because I prepared like a raft of jokes that um, I have in my back pocket here. Hang on a sec. <laughs> okay, you're off the hook. Oh, <laughs> all right. Get you in the long grass.
<laughs> yeah, see, it's an ending, but it's not quite an ending. Yeah. It's a work in progress. <laughs> So this is a this is a, an opportunity to play uh, the next tune's a cover and uh, it's a cover by a harpist from California. No, is she? I'm not sure actually. Do anybody know Joanna Newsom out there in the great wide internet world or in the immediate confines of this room? <laughs> yeah, she's American, right? Yeah, um, she's amazing. Truly amazing artist, and uh, a cousin of Kate's, Peter Doran, was getting married, and he asked us to uh, to knock out a tune at the wedding, and sent along this, and it's such a beautiful tune, number one. Um, but it also happens to be a very special song for a friend of mine, Michael. Um, so I'm going to be very bold and dedicate this to Michael. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Want to go for it? Yeah. Hi. That means no Where I come from And I am cold out Waiting for the day to come I bite my lip And I scratch my nose Feels so good to be Oh 
Thank you. <laughs> so we're gonna uh, we're gonna finish up with just one more. And, uh, thank you very much again for having us. Uh, it's absolutely lovely, and we're really looking forward uh, to the next set as well. That'll be a lovely surprise. <laughs> Yeah, we had a, an opportunity last night to check out like an extensive check out of Joshua Burnside. Of course, you're going to be aware of Joshua Burnside if you live in Ireland or perhaps maybe anywhere. But uh, we've definitely been aware of him on the, on the scene. And, uh, and we've, we've come across tracks, but we had a good dollop of it last night at home on the internet. And uh, really, really can't wait to be sitting on the other side of that camera looking up here in a couple of minutes. And I hope you stick around and you really enjoy it too. Oh, I was supposed to be telling jokes, wasn't I? <laughs> Hang on a minute. I have some here. This actually just doesn't work. Now, you won't do that. Heart open wide No armor have you built inside Just stepping stones you place before you One by one To bring you forth and with these stones, so freely laid, you move. Could you? 
Thank you. Okay, hopefully you enjoyed that. Fantastic stuff from Kate and Seamus there. Um, I just want to take a moment and uh, tell you about the Ghost Light Sessions, which is almost back to normality again. And next month in August, we will be back to our regular slot of the first Wednesday of the month. So if you're interested in coming along, please check out the Ballard website for tickets and information about lineups. Now, next up, we have a very special act. All the way from Belfast, we have Mr. Joshua Burnside. No, I, no, I, no, I'm a seer. You are, you are the blood that flows through me. Flowing, flowing, flowing like the blue Danube. No, I, no, I, through the heart of an empire. Tobacco under and dark cinnamon apples glowing, glowing, cast monsters on the mezzanine. No, I, no, I, why were you so kind to me? No, I, no, I, don't let them hide. new song called Noah Mercier 
um, about a French circus performer uh, who falls in love with an Irish giant from Ross Trevor called Patrick Murphy. It's sort of mostly fictional. And this is a song called The Only Thing I Fear Is Myself. In the key of E, I think. <laughs> My parents were out working Your voice is in the attic As your face is in TV static Tigers in the garden Ghosts under the stairs And under my bed behind the curtain Always feel the presence lurking Now that I am older, the only thing I fear is myself. Yeah, the voice is in the attic where my Well, I don't know what I did last night. I don't know what I said. Make you run a mile from me, there's thunder in my head. Oh, when the day is dying, I take my potion and float above that endless ocean. But careful friend, this useful tonic will boil the blood inside your stomach. And the only thing I fear is myself. Yeah, the voice is in the attic where I Yeah, the only thing I fear is myself yeah. mm. Well, I just can't find peace in my soul No, I just can't find Well, this persistent illusion that everything is moving forward is the weather fin. Spin, spin, spin. And the only thing I fear is myself. Yeah, the voices in the attic. Yeah, the only thing I fear is myself, yeah. That I feel lonely when I'm with you Lonely when I'm with you It's so when you're with me and not with me You're with everybody else Killed a million things tonight Fly to the mud in the dusty light Just to have you to myself again I would have waged a war on everything Do you remember when we first met? We 
It's like something from a film You were passed on the balcony Undisturbed by the cacophony of Paris in the morning Into the mystic blare night Of a party long abandoned Safe where future never enters Off to the cold coast Where old ghosts are often heard the most She said you think you're smarter than you are I said I trade it all to know you more Than at the margin of the ocean Waves crashing in the dark Screaming Mr. Tambourine Man, no oh, I love what I knew of you then Didn't you love what you knew of me then? Like a vampire's reflection in a mirror far away. If you could only see me again, you could only see me new again. Yes, I'd wage a war on everything. Yes, I'd wage a war on everything. Oh, become a stranger to myself. Sounded all right. Um, it was a bit with a cello. It was really, really rocking. <laughs> I like that. Um, that's the kind of a new tune as well that we're still kind of um, working out how to play. It's called War and Everything. Um, and uh, this next one is called. Should we do hologram? Because it's chill. Sparkles on the 
choppy days But I don't care what they say If I have to dance alone, I will bad habit of changing the set list every time we play so that uh, just keep yeah keep me you on your toes I, I, I don't know why I did honestly <laughs> I feel like uh, yeah I don't know sometimes it's just in the mood for a different tune and I kind of follow that mood much to your dismay Uh, this is this is an older tune called Grips. You may wonder why I sneak at night downstairs into the kitchen. Why the port cask finished the song? All diminished in the morning. Well, I've written many a song in my short time, but this song.
guess than I knew. But I don't know why people bring you grips when you're not well. Well, you know. Time for one more tune. One more? Yeah. Unless he's, he's, he's had enough. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's so nice to be in this beautiful building, um, surrounded by lovely. Lovely people. Uh, it's, yeah, I just want to thank you guys for having us. It's class to be doing something that, you know, it feels like a real, a real gig. Heck, it is a real gig. Um, yeah. Cheers. This one's uh, another, another song, new song called Whiskey Whiskey. And it's about my fear of flying. I'm not a good flyer, so um, I wrote a song about that when I was on a flight to London one time, just to kind of distract myself from the situation. Um, I, I often find I, I'm getting like early, really early flights for like meetings or whatever, or gigs, or just for any reason. And I would drink a, a lot of whiskey to get through the flight to calm my nerves, but then I would land in London feeling really tired because I've been up early and already hungover. It's not really a good way to start a trip. <laughs> so I had to try and rectify that behavior <clears throat> to some, some success. Oh, yeah? Not really. <laughs> <laughs> in my whiskey please Plain lurches my stomach flips and I look to the cabin crew for signs of concern but they don't give much away I am an 
Nostromane, a goddamn liberal. Man of reason, oh, the little things we tell ourselves to give us back a bit of meaning. I mean, God's been dead for a while. So if there's nowhere for our souls to go, then I don't want to be so sober. So whiskey, whiskey, no ice in my whiskey, please. Twisted metal and broken glass The lightning's gonna strike me twice This time I'm gonna do it right Whiskey, whiskey Noise in my whiskey, please Whiskey, whiskey Noise in my whiskey, please I ain't gonna die sober